Welcome to the weather forecast for the week beginning Wednesday, March 20th, 2024. This is Chief Meteorologist John Ensworth for Longmont Public Media. I'm just getting this recording slipped in here. We're going to have the bell go off in four minutes. I'm sorry. So full moon on Sunday, March 20th. Uh, some big active spots coming around on the sun. We're still in near a solar maximum for drought conditions that precipitation that came in knocked things back from severe to moderate in the southern mountains looking nationwide not nothing much changes and that's kind of what winter is like uh, we do have fires in the central and southeast part of the nation and that got some smoke mixing into the uh, equation looking at the snowpack for this snow season we've been hovering around below until, of course, this big storm that dumped feet of snow. Now, statewide, we're at about 107%. So, we've we're got a good bump right about peak season here. Looking at the previous storm, Thursday, four, six, five, seven inches of snow around Longmont. Boulder, five, six, seven, nine, ten, thirteen inches of snow on the first part of the storm. The second day picked up. Three, four and a half inches more. Uh, four, six, seven, eleven, fifteen. There's a twelve in there. Um, so very, very good snow. Big stuff up in the mountains here. Precipitation-wise, two and a half to three, four inches in places. We got two and a half inches of water, snow melt and all, in my um, backyard in the southwest. Got some great rain too. Uh, looking at Severe conditions, we got uh, really nothing in the state until Thursday, a little bit in the northeast, and then clears out for Friday. For Wednesday, uh, we have a stationary front out on the plains, moving ways, temperatures rebound. We got some snow in the mountains, rain showers in the mountains up for Friday. Weather 5280 site has been down for uh, about a week or more, so I had to go someplace else for some of this data. Normal high 56 goes up to 58. Normal low 28 to 30. Um, so we're almost above freezing for our normal low temperature. That's fantastic. <clears throat> Here's our chance of precipitation Sunday into Monday. Looking at atmospheric moisture, we've got a system down in Texas and a new one brewing up in the Gulf of Alaska. And the next notable system is this big trough in the west on Sunday. Kind of messy, a couple lobes of uh, low pressure there. The low forms pretty far north with that big snow closing, uh, school closing snow further north. Then it kind of wraps around and gets us Sunday night, Sunday midnight into Monday morning early. So put this into motion. You can see the ridge right now, and warm temperatures into the first part of the weekend, and the trough starts to carve its way down and roll over us Sunday into Monday. And a piece of the energy goes way far south, passing by, and then going into oh no, announcements. Attention. So that. Uh, a second system at the end of the week could be another Thursday storm system then looking at the cold air coming down we have it sitting out there on that stationary front <coughs> pushing down into Texas in the southeast but we have this real warmth here until the next trough carves its way down bringing a cold front with a wrap around on that low and it stays a little cool for a few days and then starts to warm up very nicely in the first part of the week. For moisture, I'll just show this through the passage of the first system for Sunday into Monday. Here comes the low. And it tightens up, really wraps some stuff around, then dry air flows in very quickly. For dew points, this is really a fun one this time. You can see all the gulf moisture sitting out on the plains getting pushed down by a front and then it suddenly gets sucked up into the low and it wraps around really tightly. That'll be our chance of rain or snow. Maybe thunderstorms on Sunday is even possible. Then super dry air comes on in. So I'll watch this first storm. There's that system in the south moving off and away. Here comes the low organizing snow far to the north. Wraps around, hits us, 
and then kind of skirts out real fast. Got snow showers in the mountains, and then rain showers with another little ripple that comes in. So without weather 5280, just have to see maybe a half inch or so of precipitation around Longmont, an inch just to the mountains. For snow, you got six to eight, eight inches in the nearby foothills, but maybe only a coating to a couple inches. This could hop up to be a few more inches. One site is now saying two to four inches Sunday night into Monday morning. Uh, then maybe you get to about an inch, inch and a half uh, over the next 10 days. California's getting a lot of water. And, but not much more snow, so the temperatures are warming up. So 60s and 70s into the weekend, cools down a little bit, not great temperatures for a lot of snow, and then it's out and away with just a little lingering stuff on Tuesday. Longmont Leader, place for great weather updates. If things change with this system, I'll post it there and look for great local news. This has been Chief Meteorologist John Insworth, urging you to keep looking up.